A lot of mixed emotions around the country and right here in the valley. So we went to Sky Harbor to talk to travelers to see how they're feeling after today's announcement. I felt like it, sh it should have felt like a surprise and it just wasn't. I think we all kind of felt it coming. Some travelers say they think Trump was going to win, but with Biden dropping out, that could change. In my opinion, it seemed like Trump was probably going to win after that. So Biden dropping out is definitely interesting. Biden announced plans to not seek re-election and throw his support behind Vice President Kamala Harris. The news is getting a lot of people thinking about what's next. We just got off a plane from Indianapolis. Bob Brock says he was not surprised, especially after the debate and the assassination attempt. I looked at my wife and said, has there ever been a crazier 30 days in American political history? I don't think so. Some people tell me they were going to vote for Trump regardless. You know my honest opinion? I was very pleased. Sarah Melgoza supports Trump and his running mate, J.D. Vance. We're Trump fans. We're very much in support of Trump and his w wanting to change America. But her sister-in-law, Juana Melgoza, tells me She'll support whoever the Democrats choose. We're divided as far as families, but um, I, I think the stuff that uh, Biden has done in his administration is for the good. Um, I'm LGBT, so I feel that if I go, we go red, all, all our rights go away. So Melgoza, one of many to acknowledge Biden's contributions over the years. I'm sad to see him go, but I'm happy that he's going to pass it along to hopefully somebody that can continue the great things that he was doing. He's a great guy. He's been around a long time. Youngest senator ever and then the oldest president ever. He, that covers a lot of ground. A lot of the people that I talked to said this shakeup might get some people excited and even more people out to the polls. Of course, we'll let you know what happens. Reporting in Phoenix, Patrick Case, ABC 15, Arizona.